I'm Peter Astors, I'm the owner of Peak UK. I started my company back in 1990 when I was a canoe slalom athlete. I moved to Nottingham like everyone did back there to train at the water sports centre uh, and I worked in a local kayak shop to uh, fund myself to live away from home. I became ill, I got glandular fever, became a little bit bored and what I realised was the products in the shop that we sold, they weren't great, the fit was, was pretty terrible, the colours didn't follow fashion, the fabrics weren't very technical, so I decided to make a few garments myself. We made some samples, a lot of my other friends, kayak racing athletes, they were on the British team, they thought the gear was really great, so um, I started my company. We're based in the Derwent Valley in Derbyshire, which is a World Heritage Site. This is where 200 years ago Richard Arkwright started the world's first uh, textile industry using the power of the river. 200 years on we've brought the textile industrial revolution back to the Derwent Valley. With help from Roland, sublimation printing, we brought it into the digital age. We built our own premises here in Darley Dale. The whole place we designed around uh, space for installing large format Roland sublimation printing equipment. 2012 was a great year for us. The goal was to get products made for the 2012 Olympics in London. It was amazing because our friends took gold and silver. So in 2016, with help from Roland, we um, developed a unique garment called the Racer ST. It combined a kayaking jacket with its life jacket and spray deck as a three-in-one jacket. What this meant was we reduced the buoyancy thickness on the athlete's body by half to 20 millimetres. This meant that Team GB's Joe Clark could race down that Olympic course quicker than anybody else and he took the gold medal. Although personally I've never won an Olympic medal myself, I feel that my business, my team here at Darley Dale have been part of many gold and world championship great performances. With the dye sublimation process enabling us to print custom gear for many national teams, I'm sure we'll see many more medals again in the future. Oh